You know, on a normal day you'd be standing where I am, behind the safety of this glass. Like you're in a zoo watching some animals. Speaking of zoos, it's almost assembly time, where all the doors open, so we must keep this brief. Look, uh, I'm sorry I hit you, but you gotta understand. I needed something from you that I could only get if you were unconscious, and I was all out of sedatives. If you'd seen me, you wouldn't have trusted me, I, I know it. But there was one thing I didn't lie to you about, and that's me knowing why you're here. You're here for your children. I too am I'm working towards saving them, if you can believe it. But someone else has them. Someone far stronger than you and me both that resides deep in the abyss. Oh no, you've got to go. There is an elevator in Opilla Bird's walkway. Take it and, and we'll talk again down there. You've been a bad student. Okay, bird riding is a new one, I'll give you that. What drives you forward so vigorously? I refuse to accept that it's your protective parental instincts. Oh, I know. Someone has given you false hope. Promised you what you want when all along they had one thing on their mind. Pancreases. At first, I was confused by how everything was going perfectly in your favor, despite you never being here before. And then it hit me. Someone has to have been guiding you. And as with most things, I was right. You did have help. Your friend here has helped me tremendously. Thanks to him. I bore witness to very vital information. What information, you ask? Well, when my turn comes, I will simply prevent myself from turning into what he turned into.
Your Majesty, I have finally come to do what I was made for, and deliver my jokes! This is my best back yet! I command you to leave, and not tell any jokes! Oh no! Look at what you have done! Oh, they grow up so fast! Too bad she's about to get completely crushed! This is chaos! I follow every single one of your orders! Why won't you give me that satisfaction one last time? All I want is to make you laugh. But you know what will happen if I laugh? I do. And I told myself time and time again that some things are more important than laughter. But I can't wait anymore! I need to make you laugh, even if just for a little bit. I can't be put aside again. I am nothing without a ruler to entertain! I am sorry. Your Majesty, tell me, what did the train conductor say to the kangaroo? Hop on! <laughs> that was terrible. It can only go down, but right now, we have to escape this entire floor to anywhere else!
thing we've worked so hard to build. Just ruined. I've let the other prisoners go. Grab this one. Things he knows will definitely be useful. If we make it down there alive, we need to find the Queen's Scepter. It's the only thing that can stop this madness. When I couldn't find the switch on my floor, I headed back. Figured I'd get lost trying to find you. But you did it! We can now put an end to this chaos. Hold on. First, I need to do something. I don't think he'll have naughty ones to worry about soon. Let's get this over with. Didn't think I'd be seeing this room again this soon. The surgeon is supposed to be in here protecting the scepter. Where'd he go? I doubt he was caught by the naughty ones. Everything would be in shambles if he was. Well, we can only look for him if we have the scepter. It seems eerily simple to just click the eject button. Are we sure we want to press it? A piece. That's not good. So, this is where the key to bind prison was stored away. Impressive work. All switches activated, the big door opened, and the treasure ready to be plundered. I fear this is the part where I come in and take all of your hard work for myself. I can sense I'm not the only one in this room that's good at this. Consider it a small part of the payback for what was done to me. Plus, I need to make sure history doesn't repeat itself. We had no choice! They were going to destroy us all! You didn't have a choice, and you chose wrong. Where are the Sheriff and the Sergeant? Surely me coming in here and taking the scepter wasn't part of your grand plan. I... I don't know where they are. I'll tell you, they are hiding like the cowards you all are. But I'll find them, and all will pay. Seems the scepter is incomplete too. Are you going to tell me where the missing piece is, or am I going to have to eat your pit kitty? You won't be doing any of that. Forget what happened between us before. You know you've always been my friend. But what are friends for if not for times like these?
I can go! What? What do you mean? You wouldn't understand. They appreciate my jokes. Who's they? This is my one chance to have an audience. And I am going to take it! Goodbye! <laughs> Everything they have worked so hard for must be for nothing. Both of you will be a fine addition to my army. Together and under my command, we will finish what the Queen couldn't. I'll hold them off. Look for the surgeon. mean you didn't find him. But wait, what's that you got there? Is that a Joyvanium sample? He must have gotten hurt trying to flee the darkness. Well, this is even better than actually finding him. We can use this to lure him to wherever we want. Come with me. I hate to use my supreme knowledge about Joyvanium against my own kind, but it is what it is. After the facility abandoned the entire previous wave of cases and threw them in the lower levels, which included myself, they saw another use for me. I had four arms, equipped with important tools, and I would never tire or get hungry. The facility recruited me to participate in just about every facet of their operations. One of the cases that came under me hand was Jumbo Josh. Let's just say that we managed to create a case that behaves like an adult male gorilla more than an actual adult male gorilla. He's curious and he's territorial. Once he senses another gorilla in its proximity, he'll come. This sample will smell like an entirely different specimen with a few tweaks. You see where I'm going? Plus, I've prepared a little contraption that might also help us with pulling this off. Sir Dadadu won't suspect a thing. This is the golden chance. We're out here making history, and all some of us care about is going to a beach. this scepter piece with the modified version of the sample you had. It's so potent that even the Queen can smell it from all the way up there, if she's even still capable of smelling. Ready? Place yourself. I don't know how this is going to go. Dadadu! You win! The scepter piece is yours! Maybe it was too obvious? We meet again, old friend. Last I recall, friends didn't imprison each other. You have every right to be mad at us. I would be too. But you have to understand that we were forced to do what we did. Here is what truly happened. Our plan failed, and all of you were too cowardly to face the punishment. So you took the easy way out, and made me pay alone for all of us. Nothing you could say or do will be enough to make up for all of these cold nights I had spent inside of that pouch. I can't describe how good it feels to see you all cowering in fear of me. Destroy the old you 
before it destroys you. Isn't that what you used to tell us? And it worked. You gave us all hope when we lost everything. You gave us something to fight for. Now I need you to do the opposite. Destroy this new you. It has this bitter outlook on life that would have never gotten us this far. By turning on each other, they win. You are always a small father of my son. But it's not going to work. I know you have a trap set up somewhere. You don't think I know you and all of your tricks? You know what? Whatever the trap may be, my army will take care of you. Anyway. <laughs> I knew it. Javinium will be spelled. Any last words before I command my army to devour you? Get in the box! About to get knackered. Oh, good. You're up. The plan worked. But the scepter was destroyed in the process. It's better this way, if you ask me. Nobody should have that much power. Everyone that was brainwashed is back to normal now. And corpses of the naughty ones litter the streets. I don't remember the last time I felt like I wasn't scared for my life. This feels good for a change. We've been through a lot. We should rest, and when you wake up, we can discuss what we're gonna do next.
Why does it look like we can peel that drawing on the wall? What's that? That drawing on the wall. Seems like there's something behind me. Hmm, weird. I would just leave it alone. Uh, you two should rest. That's a good idea. Who knows what could be behind it? Just leave it alone. Never play with the devil. Doctor's orders!